James, James chapter 2, verse 5. Hawking, my beloved brethren, has not Yahweh chosen the poor of this world, rich in faith, and heirs of the kingdom, which he had promised to them that love him. I'd like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh Shemel Shah, Bashem Kankadash, the Wadi Yahweh Shemel Shah, for giving us the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who deserve the wildness by his soul. Shalom to the Aki, I'm pushing the word of sincerity and truth for being faith based and being prepared for what is to come. And what is to come? Race wars, famine, concentration camps, the RFRD chip, which is the mark of the beast. 200 million missiles sent the slaves of America. Simultaneously, the terrorists of the Lord look up the whole full life into the chambers. Simultaneously, the terrorists of the Lord shooting laser beams to the ungodly and the heathens. Rightfully so. Hey, I'll be right beside the Lord at the course of this video. Make it edifying. Uh, build your faith up. Keep you in tune. Just a vessel seeking salvation. Uh, this filthy place known as um, Miss Bitter, aka Babylon, aka Sodom and Gomorrah, aka uh, Egypt. So, um, as you can see, the time is. 2 a.m. in the morning, right? 2 10 in the morning, and now uh, it's the year to turn up. And everything is turning up the way Yahweh Yahweh Shah wanted to turn up. It's accurate for him, so he's making it accurate for his prophets, the ones that believe and have faith in him, and him and his son Yahweh Yahweh Shah. So I was just reading the verse. As I got this verse, I got this precept from Revelation chapter, um, Revelation chapter two, verse nine. God is going over my doors of daily leisure. So I can, and um. I thought about this verse earlier, so I was like, wow. Yahweh Shah said it himself that he's only coming for the ones that's rich in faith. Because that's where your money lies at. Your faith in Yahweh Yahweh Shah. You know? Which right now is it's, it's the only way, it's the only, um, <clears throat> Um, it's on, it's the only money that you want, you have. You know, I just thought about something. I just, I don't know if I can find it now. Jeez. Um. Yeah, let's read this again. Uh, James chapter 2, verse 5. Hawk it. Just listen, brothers. You know, my beloved brethren, has not Yahweh chosen the poor of this world, rich in faith, and heirs of the kingdom, man? Which he had promised to them that love him. And who's that person who's supposed to love you? Supposed to love you love Yahweh Yahweh Shah. Because I will all. Uh, our. Um, how you say it? Our mediator is Yahweh Shah. And he's presenting your case to the Lord. 
He got his team out there, his defenders, which is the angels, out there defending you, taking your case, pleading for you. Because the Lord is defending us. Time to verses prove that he's defending us. He, he's, he said vengeance is his. So we can't take it upon ourselves to um, do nothing. All we got to do is pray that Yahweh Yahweh Shah, you know. And, um, you know, I've got this prayer on my wall, which I say every day, you know. Cease not to pray. And um, I just want to say it real quick, too. It's um, Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah Bahashim Raka Kodash. Babakusha, 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 Babakusha. With Babakusha means please, 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 please. Alright. Alright. Shalakya, Sha'al, Kataya. Alright, so. Shalakya means forgive me. Right? Salakya means forgive me. Right? Sha'al, Kataya, Babakusha, Babakusha, Babakusha. And Babakusha means please. You know? And um and it's something we gotta beg the Lord. Shalakya. Shalakya. Please send me. Mercy, Kasadium, Kasadium is mercy. Kasadium, 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 Kasadium is mercy. Alright, and we know the water means thank you. The water, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shah, Bashem, Kamudash, the Wab, Aman. The Wab means good. Aman means Aman. So be it, let it be so. You know, and that's what we're supposed to do every day. Pray to the Lord for forgiveness, you know, and mercy. Because you gotta have fear in your know, shot. I had a few verses that I was going over, but um, just totally forgot where it was at. Now, a couple, I got a lot of different tabs open, so I can, you know, there's someone in here. There was a verse I was reading, I totally sort of snatched it out. Bear with me for a second. Because fear is the key element to your high boss and your shot. Um, Good one. One of the key elements. So, who could say God is love, but. What, what, what happened when you read the scriptures? They don't say that in there. You know? It does say those that love him. And, and, um, love, um, love is commandments. Doing his commandments. And to your best of your ability, we're supposed to be doing his commandments. You know, we know that a lot of laws we can't apply, but there's laws to the best of your ability you can apply to your general life, all right? So that's what you're supposed to be working on. And your number one, um, oh, jeez. There was a verse I was reading and I totally lost it. I wasn't. Which I, I I wasn't um I found I found these verses and it made me now this verse jumped back to my head so I just wanted to read it you know which I was just doing some daily leisure and I came across that verse earlier but it seemed like it just jumped right back in my head I know it's around here somewhere well anyway let's get this one I know this one's easy that's um just the, um, this is this is icing the cake right here. 
this verse right here. You can forget it. Yeah, yeah. You can, once I find this verse, you're done, Ashashi. Because we ain't got to have no fear. We don't have to have no fear in you. All right? We got fear. We got Ashashi. 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 We, we don't have no We don't have to have no fear in you. We don't have to have. We don't have to do with none of your wisdom. Your shit is garbage, man. Straight ba basuda. <laughs> All right, so let's lock here. All right, this is Isaiah, because um, this is riches, okay? Maybe if um, I find a few verses based upon this right here, because this is riches. Look, with Isaiah chapter 33, verse 6, And wisdom and knowledge shall be thy stability of, thy t of the time, of thy time, and strength of salvation. Okay, so who you have supposed to have um, wisdom and knowledge on? Yahweh Yahweh and what his what his what he wants you to do. Okay, here's the key point right here. Look, the fear of the Lord Yahweh Yahusha, is his treasure. That's our treasure, man. It was a verse I was reading that I, I can't. I, I, the words ran right on my tongue, but I can't figure out how to say it <laughs> again. I found it earlier. I just want to see something. All right, Salak. It, it, um, it was a good verse. Wow, it keep bouncing around in my head. Damn, it was really, really good, man. I'm sorry, so lucky. I was waking up, dozing off, you know, reading verses. And like, this verse was really, really good, man. Like, I was like, wow, what it said. I just, I don't know what I, what it, so lucky. I got so many tabs open. All right, so, um. All right, I just want to read this. Psalm chapter 112, verse, verse, verse 1. Praise ye the Lord Yahweh Yahweh Shah. Blessed is the man that feareth the Lord Yahweh Yahweh Shah, that delighteth greatly in his commandments. And we do delight. When we, when we found out all these glorious things, and if we will apply it, we gonna, he's going to provide for us. If we apply his laws, he's going uh, uh, gonna, to he's gonna provide for us. Okay? With great success, we will live. All right. Right. Look what it says right here. Oh man, I just saw this right now. Look, it says Psalms chapter one twelve verse three. The next verse: Wealth and riches shall be in his house. All right. Hold on. What is that? Oh, hold on. Let's go back up. Let's read all three of these verses. All right. Um, Psalm chapter 112, verse 1. Praise ye the Lord, Yahweh, Yahweh, shall bless the man that feareth the Lord, Yahweh, Yahweh, shall, and delighteth greatly in his commandments. His seed shall be mighty upon the, upon earth. The generation, the, I'm telling you, the Lord, go. he takes care of you generational. The generations of the upright shall be blessed. Wealth and riches shall be in his house. And his righteousness endure forever. See? The, when you fear Yahweh, I was shocked. Man, that verse, it was a verse, bro. It was fire wristed. It really was, man. I, I don't know where it was at. I got so many tabs open, I can't even, I, I was scared to close it. I think it was somewhere around here. It was a really good verse. Like, it was really, I found it. I was like, wow, look what that says. Um, 